got something to do at the Bridge Johanna for me. Fine. How are you? Fine. Welcome to my Nairobi. Is this your car? Yeah, my winning car. Wow, Mshidi, she's super. I bet she can fly. <laughs> Not quite that fast, but fast enough to win the safari. show you my town. Sure glad you could come and see me. You could win all the races in this car. You know, Johanna, this is the tallest building in town. There's a restaurant on top with a super view. Well, Johanna, what do you think of my village? <laughs> You're speechless. <laughs> Drink your cock. We've got a lot to see. so many things in one shop? Huh? Like those shoes? Johanna? This way. Look, there's the park.
Can I help you, sir? Ah, sure. Just a tropical rum for me. How about you, Johanna? Anything? Anything. Vanilla ice cream with chocolate fudge and nuts. Uh-huh. And where did you land that combination? In a western film they showed on the local TV one night. Glad to hear that the Wazirs are willing to become a little modern. Sir, is that all? Sure. Some layout, huh? What is a layout? Uh, a layout? Well, I mean... This pool, these good-looking tables and chairs. That's beautiful. Any special news from home? Things haven't changed much. Mother is still against your driving safari cars. Yes. I know it's difficult for them to understand. But it pays your school fees and Hannah's and Joseph's. I don't hear complaints about that. Come on, hurry up and eat your sandy. I've got to get back to work. Do you want to make it in okay? Yeah. We toured around town. I even introduced him to Mona. Mona, you! <laughs> uh, Steve, why don't you say hello to Johanna? Show him around. See that Alphonse and I are not disturbed. Sure, no problem. Your friend, what's bugging you? When are you going to pay me for the work I've done on the test and safari cars? We may be partners, but I want my money and I want it sasa hivi. Alfonso, you know I'm operating under heavy overdraft. I can't pay you your few shillings now. Be patient. Be patient? I've been patient enough since joining this team, as you may like to call it. I need money. Look, I need money. Please, Mochiri. This is all the money you are giving me? 300 bob? I think you need a new man. This is a Shinzi outfit. Since we have just lost our head mechanic. Oh, great. That's just what we need now. Look, you two. I need a little change. You know, I'm looking forward to our little party tonight.
man. This is really living. I'm a little tense tonight. I need to get away from this trip. Money. Alfonso. Relax, would you relax? <laughs> You're right, Mr. Navigator. Beautiful sky. Thanks for getting me out in the air, Steve. We have that war he'll run tomorrow. What time do you have? Midnight. Why midnight, Juma? Midnight? I find it pleasing to my disposition for work. Alfonso. Alfonso, when will you ever learn? Sometimes I have deep doubts about your ability to contribute to our little operation. Now, now, don't get upset. When you lose, you must pay. It's that simple. It's just that simple. When we lose, we pay. And now, Alfonso, you've been losing right along, and you have not paid. You know that financially I'm all tied up. All I need now is a little more time. Machiri's car is about to be placed. And our financial interest... Sit down, Alfonso. You make me uncomfortable standing there. Ah, yes. Shiriska. He has done well in the local rallies this year. And at the rate he's going, he's bound to be well placed in the safari. Then you see, I can clear my debt with you in no time. Your debt could be cleared and 20,000 bob in your pocket. Don't joke with me. Joke? No, my friend. We need your help. You're in a key position to help. You help? We are grateful. What do you think? I... I don't know what to think. I have no... This stick is between you and me. I want to break it. To finish off the debt between you and me. I want to help. Here, Alphonse. You break it yourself. What do I do to help? Remove Mushiri. Do what? Remove Mushiri. We want the odds in favor of another man. Mushiri stands in the way. If you remove him, your debt will be removed. Plus 20,000 in your pocket. What do you mean, remove? What do you mean, Juma? Don't be a child. 
the man has to be removed now before the rally begins you remove him or we might have to remove you do you understand me I do understand too well. Good. Good. You're making a wise choice. What are you doing down there? Just a small adjustment. Sort of for what happened yesterday. All right, forget about it. Is the car ready for today's run? Ready. The bricks are ready. Hey, I wonder what happened to this. There's a dent here. I don't know. Must have been hit by a rock or something. Well, we can check it up later. Sure. This is our route today. Through the Kilungu Hills. Could be very dangerous if it's wet this year. This is where the winner was decided a couple of years ago. We must carefully time each curve, bend and turn. Each one is critical at this particular run. Isn't there a jump on one of these streets? Right, here. Alphonse will remember it. Lucky, no damage except to the tire. This delay means we'll be traveling in the dark. I was hoping to avoid that today. You've driven in the dark before, haven't you? Yeah, once or twice. Well, you look tired. Why don't you and Johanna go and relax? I'll change the tire. Well, okay. I've driven past this forest many times during reckeys and rallies. And this is the first time I've had time to stop and enjoy it. These trees are more than enough timber to build Mama a palace. Eh, Joanna? 
found something? Nothing really. Bet he can fly as fast as your car. Now he can't. What did you do that for? Oh, it's only a bug. Hey, why are you so upset over a bug? Why do we have to show so little liking for God's creation? We are always so ready to destroy without thinking of about what we are doing. Ah, <laughs> my brother is becoming a philosopher. Johanna, are you serious? Does this God's creation mean so much to you? Yes. You know why? Okay. Why? I've come to know that it's really possible to know God personally through His Son, Jesus Christ. Oh, come of it, Johanna. You have swallowed the Bible. What do you know of God? Or the world? Hey, you two. Ready to go? Kilometers. There's a market corner, some animals, goats and donkeys. Don't we have a boot? We can put the donkey in the boot. <laughs> that bad jump is ahead. Let's take it at high speed and give Johanna a thrill. He's coming to. Although mild concussion. No broken bones. Sister. Assign him to Ward L9. 
relatives arrived? No one, but we are trying to notify them up country. Fine. Leave a note for me. I'm Sister Esther, Mr. Bore. You need to rest. Tada. What happened? You are slightly drugged. It's very early in the morning. No time for conversation. Look. I need to know what is happening. Go to sleep. We'll talk about it later. Morning, sister. Morning, doctor. Mrs. Bure, what's your mother? Hello, Mrs. Bure. I've just come looking at Mushiri's x-rays. There's a slight concussion, but so slight that there is no need to worry. Although he has torn ligaments in his right knee. In two days time, he should be all right and should be able to leave the hospital on his own. It has cost us so much. Please accept my deepest sympathy concerning your younger son. Sister, they may go in to see Muchiri if they wish. Yes, doctor. Please follow me. A little light, Mr. Bure. You have visitors. Visitors? Johanna? Ah, oh. Mother? Doris? Paul? Why oh, is Johanna? Mother? Speak to me. Why is Johanna? These people say nothing to me. What's the matter, Doris? Paul? They're gone, Mchi. Johanna is with God. What do you mean, with God? They are dead, son. Stephen, yesterday, and Joanna, this morning. Oh, my God. Why? I didn't want this. Not Johanna. Muchiri. How many times have I told you about the hope we have? He is with Jesus. My heart is sad, but I have peace. I have given you both to God.
she's right, you know. Right. About what? Jesus? God? Yes, about God and Jesus Christ, his son. All I really know is they are dead. Dead if I understand. Do you really Muchiri? I've seen death. Seeing death and understanding it are two very different things. This helped me. I think it will help you. Wouldn't you like to read it? Spiritual loss. What's this taka taka? Haven't I had enough for a day? Here, take away your booklet and spiritual laws. Jesus. God, what's going on? I might want to see this. We made this out of a uh, wrecked car. So? Look, the steering column. Somebody cut it. He cut it. Are you sure of these photos? Dear. Tell no one of this. Let's go. Bye, Rafi.
come, my son. Christ said, I am come that you might have life and have it more abundantly. And because of this, we who also love the Lord Jesus can bear witness that right now Johanna Mtugimbure is now rejoicing in the presence of his Savior. This is our victory, our hope. Death, where is your sting? O oh, grave, where is your victory? Jesus Christ conquered sin and death through his own resurrection. Very soon, Jesus is coming back to claim his own. We who love him shall live with Jesus forever. Let us witness Johanna's love of his savior. I was Johanna's Sunday school teacher. He was faithful in doing his lessons and memorizing God's word. We miss him. I have watched Johanna always help his mother, especially when his father went to be with the Lord. He was always a good example to others. Johanna was my student. He did his lessons well and always showed respect to his elders. He was not afraid to tell others of his love of Jesus. My son is not dead. His faith and my faith are in the risen Savior. He's dead. He's dead. I know he's dead, but I also know that he's in God's presence. My greater sadness and fear is for you, my son. I can't understand it, mother. Goodbye, my son. You are with the Lord, and I am satisfied.
watch your grave. You'll pay Alfonso for what you wish the Mbore family. I swear. I swear I'll locate you, you murderer. Kill, wait! How can you do this to mother? You're the head of this home. There are things I need to do as the head of this family. Are you sure Alfonso is the one who wished us this evil? Sure? Yes. He's the one. And now he's running scared. Do you think it's the time we inform the police? You have the photos. This is Madame Muchiri. I know that. I want Alfonso for myself. No one else. I'm against it. I know your mother is. Mother. She would pray for him. I've got to think. with my mother's God.
this will relieve some of the pain. Monsieur, I've been thinking. What if I support you, make it financially possible for you to go back in the rally? You're joking. I am serious. Like most people here, I have rally fever. In fact, as a member of Flying Doctors, I participate in helping you men when medical care is called for. Besides, I believe in you. You've got a good track record, and I want to support it. Interested? Yeah, interested. <laughs> Hello. It's your day off? Hello. Back to work this afternoon. That Dr. Mbarak is quite, quite the man. He really knows how to give me life. Really? <laughs> yeah, he's going to sponsor me. What do you mean? Ah, uh, Esther, why don't you give me a chance to tell you all about it? How about a small safari, just you and me? A little therapeutic help, Mochiri? <laughs> if you want to call it that. Are you free tomorrow? Yes, tomorrow afternoon. I'll tame the savage driver. <laughs> For that remark, I'll let you drive. <laughs> okay, see you. me off guard. She's a beauty. Hmm? Yeah. It's too bad. This can't be the one. I'm sorry too. Money is money. Right now our budget can only get us a used safari car. There's a car here I checked yesterday. It looks good. I want you to be Dr. Mbarak, my key sponsor. How do you do? Well, what do you think about it, Bichuri? The deal is too good to turn down. Well, my deals are always good. The deal is that Dobby will cover the cost of the service crew, plus one-third the cost of the car. Can you give us a few minutes? Sure. Well, Muchiri, are you sure this is the car you want? The car you can win with? Yes. I've looked and looked. The engine is sound. Good. This is the best deal in town. That is all I need. Let's go see Ahmed. sure we're on the right route. I see. <laughs> <laughs> I've been wondering, Esther, about 
that booklet you tried to give me. Something about spiritual laws. Yes, spiritual laws. Want to hear them? From you? Okay. Well, God loves you and has a plan for your life. I think his plan is as good as Dr. Barak's. Oh, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> You know, Christ said, I am come that you might have life, and that it might have meaning. Does life have meaning for you? Ah, no, it does. <laughs> I've got a secret. I will not tell. <laughs> I promise. Then it wouldn't be a secret. We bought the car. Oh, Muchiri. I find it hard to believe. <laughs> oh, Muchiri, the food is really lovely. You shouldn't have spent so much. I would have made something for us. I wanted everything to be special. That was kind of you. But we hardly know each other. I know. Sticking needles in me is what I call passion. <laughs> <laughs> be serious. OK, I'll try. always praying for me. What's wrong with praying? Nothing, I guess. If it suits you. A gift for a lovely lunch. Why do you do that? The petals are much nicer together than separated. Separated? I feel separated from a lot of things. Man is separated from himself and God. This separation is caused from man's sinfulness. I just don't understand that. 
The Bible tells us that the wages of sin is death. Complete separation from God. Sin is doing what is different from God's will. You know, Esther, I believe in a God. And I certainly feel separated from him. He's always been the concern of the old people. He's off somewhere. Visiting only when he pleases. We have all felt that way. Separated. That's why Jesus Christ, God's son, came to earth and died on the cross for us. It's God's checkpoint to us. It's where we can check God's route to our life. We really have no plan for life until we know Christ. You and I are able to be brought to God because Jesus died on the cross for the sins of each of us. God's plan? My plan? Right now I don't know what to think. How does a person tie it all together? By receiving Christ as your Savior, Lord of your life, putting him first. Give up my right to myself? <laughs> That's hard talk. It doesn't make sense to me. Christ promises help. He forgives us our sins. You cannot know until you have experienced his forgiveness. Only then does it make sense. You know, I just can't forget what Johannes said. How he knew God personally. I remember how funny it struck me. It's not so funny now. He was a happy kid. Maybe there was a reason. You rejected this once. We have talked about it. Take it and read it for yourself. Good for me. What do you think you are doing, big man? Oh, come on. Pull yourself together. Let's be human. Be human? You are acting more like an animal that needs to be fed. If that's the kind of freedom your God gives you, then you can keep it. What are you laughing at? You? <laughs> I'll behave myself. Now I realize that we have different values. <laughs> How do you feel this year's safari? Well, I think that this year the safari is going to be more interesting than ever before because the route is a new one and it's most interesting. And in fact, uh, it will be taxing both the drivers and the car. 
uh, for this year for anyone to finish, let alone to win. Machidi, good yeah. to have you back. Yeah. Shareable accident, man. Glad anyway, to see you okay. here. Good. Just the back now. Okay, right. Glad to. Glad to see you. Glad to see you. about your placement in the safari this year, Muchiri? We are very pleased to be in the running, although we would have preferred a better seating.
well, I would say first class driver, but I'll say I'm going to try my luck and maybe I might do well, I might not on the other hand. Mushiri, we want to know of your new navigator, John Mbura. He's a new face with the safari in Nairobi. John was trained by my former navigator, Stephen. He knows his job. Excuse me. Mushiri Mburi is on the ramp in car number 111, one MC here, a Datsun 1600 SSS. A real favorite with the fans in Nairobi. over to the dart. Number three cut left, water jump ahead, 20% grade up here. How far is Kilomen? It's 12 kilometers. Shit. This is that big jump coming up. Hang on, John.
top, 150 meters, 95 kph. Right. Kitsugane kina kufanya. Mona, ona ni acha. Safari ni zuri. Hakuna mbuwe. I'll never let you not end it. Good. Give up driving. No, just resting. See you. Have yeah. Okay. Unbelievable what you've done, Rafiki. The team is really pulling for you. <laughs> Thanks, Phil. The service crew is doing a great job. See you in the room. All right. Hey, wait, Jimmy. I just saw car 120 pull in. Thought you might be interested. Parking area. What was ordered, he kept on saying, wait, I have no money, and I have to let you What the? I'll put you away to other is. When I catch up with you, Alfonso, when I do, Misho, I'll put you away to Hana is. Come on, Alfonso, That's get out of there. You don't know what you are talking about. Safari Rally. Please let well, any of our staff know your special needs, as we want your stay here to Relaxing, you are crazy. peaceful, and a good rest. The safari bar is open by the pool for a... Look, forget about Alfonso. 
Forget about it. Forget about it. <laughs> if you don't get some sleep, we are not going to win the safari. You don't know what you're talking about. Cool off, man. God, I have to win. Why do we have to show so little liking for God's creation? We are always so ready to destroy without thinking of, of a powerful you are doing. possible to know God personally through His Son, Jesus Christ. Know God personally through His Son, Jesus Christ. Personally. How personally, many times have I told you about the hope we have? He is with Jesus. Johanna is with God. Can I believe that? It doesn't make sense to me. Christ promises help. He forgives us our sins. You cannot know until you have experienced his forgiveness. Only then does it make sense. Maybe my values need changing. We really have no plan for life until we know Christ. God, checkpoint, 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 checkpoint.
hear that whine? Oh no, I don't believe it. We've blown a seal. Oh no, the transmission is packing up. You are kidding. of race. Get Alfonso if it kills me. We just received word that car number 111, driven by the well known Mushiri Mure, has packed up just outside of Nairobi. But we hear that car number 120 is now motoring to the city. was a tremendous finish. Um, are you happy with this second? Uh, sure I am, thank you very much. Uh -huh. And uh, what are your comments about your close call with the car number 111? We understand you tried to run each other off the road. What happened, actually? Sorry, I'll answer all the questions at the press conference. But we would, so like, to, to we would like to know about uh, uh, the second finish it has got to go to the press conference. Uh, gentlemen, members of the press, Control Nairobi will give you 10 minutes to interview the driver on the left. A tremendous rally. Alfonso, it's good to see you. Oh, yeah, it was. Thank you. Yeah, congratulations on your placing. That was tremendous. Oh, I did it. Thank you. You ready for the press conference? Yeah, I'm heading there now. Oh, good. Yeah. Alfonso, I want you.
This is the end, Alfonso. I want to pay back what you did to Joanna. I didn't survive. I won't win my battles. Just see if you can survive. Juma is not here to help you. Who wants Juma? Give you your life. Give thanks to God. Still alive, Esther. Christ won't let me do it. Oh. 